Okay, here what we are going to do is we are going to read the NetCDF file in MATLAB and convert it into a TIFF file. Let's see how we can do it. Okay, this is the file. Okay, this is the file. I'm going to give it a file name. File name. File name is equal to, okay, I'm just going to paste the complete name. All right. This is my file. Okay. Now I want now I want it to be displayed. So I will ask NC disp. NC disp. What to display is the file name. Okay. All right. So all the data of the file is displayed. So now there are a number of variables in this file. I will first of all ask it to show me the longitudes which is 180 by 1 okay let's see what is this data so I will call it longitude is equal to and see read okay read net CDF file and what is the source it is file name file name and what in the file name? Right, we have to read LLN. So it is displaying all the longitude and it is creating the matrix accordingly. You can see longitude, right? Okay, now I wanted to create a matrix of latitude. So I will name it latitude is equal to and see read okay read the netcdf file the source is file name and what in the file name it is lat okay it is going to read lat okay it has created the latitude matrix as well okay now i want the temperature data to be displayed i will name it as temp is equal to all right uh, again, NC read, NC read, and file name. The source is file name, and what in the file name? What is the variable? It is TOS. Okay, so it is displaying all the data, right? So I just do not require this much data. In the temp file, it is 180 by 170 by 24. I don't need this third dimension. I will just pick up 180 and 170 out of this temp file. So let's see. Temp is equal to actually temp file rows 1 to 180 and columns 1 to 170. Okay. So so it has picked up the file and now you can see the dimensions have changed so temp is now 180 by 170 okay all right so now I will take inverse of that temp is actually equal to temp inverse all right so now it has displayed that okay now it is 170 by 180 now these three these three matrices I can use these three matrices I can use for my map okay I name it my map is equal to I'm using the command of p color all right p color first of all longitude then latitude and then temp Let's see what it shows. Okay, it has shown the map. All right, it has shown the map. Now I will ask it to show the color bar, color bar as well. Okay. All right, color bar. Sorry for the spelling mistake. Okay, so now it is showing the color bar as well. Okay. Now. What I can do. Okay. 
load cost. So the second if the command Okay, it has loaded the coast and it has given a few other matrices to me. It has given long. Okay, long. All right. Plot long flat. Black. Let's see what it does now. Okay, now it has changed like this. Now, if I want to save this file, I can. Okay, if I want to save this file. I will just save as save as and I will call it it's a you can see it's a tiff image okay I will call it net CDF 2 so this is what it is thank you very much